Jade Goody. Since leaving the Big Brother house, Britain's most successful reality TV star has had a full-on three years. There's been breakups, babies, and a new boyfriend. And all the while, she's appeared just about everywhere and said just about everything. What job has the Queen got? <laughs> She might not be famous for her brains. I'll admit to being fit. Or good looks. Attractive. <laughs> but Jade's about to combine both and set up a beauty salon. She's got the qualifications, the cash. I'm putting 50 grand in of my own money. And a lot to get her head around. I listen, I'm very interested. But soon after they're finished, I'm just like, what was that about again? And whatever happens, we're following her every move. I am just sort of jumping at the deep end. I always tend to do that, just like something, get it, and hopefully it work. So I don't really have a clue what I'm doing. <laughs> Today on Jade Salon, no the designers are worried about Jade. She can't come in on a quick meeting like that, not knowing what she's on about. No paperwork, nothing. Jade's worried about her future manager. I don't need your help then. I need your help now. Nail training is a disaster. Oh, sorry. Just demolished your own nails. That is bleeding. And Jade puts salon stress on hold and heads for the sun. I found a property for my salon. My money's all in place and I should get the key soon. I've got a designer, a project manager, a builder, and me and my Carly are going to run here. And I'm off to a design meeting now. First zone, okay, is obviously your reception area. Make that the central point. We need seats. Well, the seat area is here. Right. Okay. This section on this side will be your nail doll. There's your normal elbow, but for us, that's a bit modern because we want to go a bit more antique yeah. so That looks a bit more antique -y. Mm, not sure about that. No? No, I don't like that at all. <laughs> <laughs> you speak up, you've got to see in this, it's part of your design as well. That was her. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> you liked that, didn't you? you yeah, I love, love that. that. I love, I love that. that. It's nice in black and white. I don't want it to look tacky. Like, one thing I don't that's want to look I'm quite sick of it looking tacky. It won't look tacky. What's that strop for? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, bear in mind, we're going to actually incorporate that wallpaper into this design. Yeah, yes. Lovely. Have we cracked it? Yes, you have yes. actually. A bit of this with the old mirrors, yep. the shards and other things, you know yeah. what I mean? Chaisons. Chaisons. Sorry, can't What are you off to? Theatre. Theatre? Yeah. Very nice. Leave us to all the work. Yeah. I'll, yeah. Do the work. I'll do the work. I'll do the work. See you later on. Yeah, nice to meet you. Bye, girl. Bye. <laughs> Would you like to get a little model? Yeah. That's going to wrap all the way around the salon. Mm -hmm. okay. That would be your reception area. Mm -hmm. Someone's sitting there, nailed the over there. So wrap that all the way around. Yeah, that's nice. Like that idea? Like hidden doors. And then what we can yeah. have, mm -hmm. we can have the royal curtains actually physically coming down there to hide this area. So what Okay, we... so you only see this through the curtains. You'll see this at that. But the curtains are going to diffuse it all. Get it comes around. Mm -hmm. No pink lights. Get I don't want to have pink lights in there. At night time, we can just glow it at night time. You want to stress. You look like a brothel. You want to stress. It won't look like a brothel. I've never worked in one. So would I know? <laughs> I have. No. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Jade. Nice Hello. to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Want you. To come on through? Yeah, thank okay. you. I found a company to supply me nail varnish. And if I'm going to do manicures, I have to do it their way. I qualified in December 2003. And since then, I've not done nothing. So. OK. So what comes first? That one. Tough as, so. There you go. Brilliant. <laughs> Have a look. Can we show the camera? Oh. <laughs> That's really good. That's actually not bad. Oh, thanks. The manicure went really well, so I was feeling really confident. And the pedicure started off really well. Are you a pedicure model? But then it ended in tears. And it's got your papain in. 
you remember what papain is? It's got a fruit abstract in it called papainia. <laughs> Oh, no! <laughs> pain is um, an active enzyme taken from the papaya fruit. Can you tell me anything about that? It's got um, papaya in it. Oh! <laughs> papain. Papain in it. Which is what? Which is an abstract from the fruit called papaya. An abstract? What am I getting that word from? I know. That's a painting, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and what Can you actually go in Tesco's or Sainsbury's and get this papaya fruit then? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm quite short toenails. Oh, sorry. I'm just chopping. Just demolished your toenails. Well, I've cut that really short. As she starts bleeding. <laughs> Does it feel a little sore? Does it? Oh, no, I'm so sorry. What have you done? Oh, Let me have don't a Don't say that, Rose. That is a little short. Hi. Whereas I'm very... My gosh, I should stop filing. <laughs> Sorry. You should have said something. When I cut Rosie's toe, I actually felt really bad because um, I hurt her. But I didn't actually cut her toe. It was just her nail a bit too short and I might have pinched her skin a bit. So it weren't very nice to hurt her, but I think she'll get over it. Right then, so, colours. Two, one, four. Three, four, nine, two. Cheek. <laughs> Cheek. <laughs> it was really exciting picking the colours, um, purely because it's the first product that I've actually picked to go in the salon, so I know that I'm picking this and it's actually going to end up in the shop, so it was quite good. We've got that one. Bright. Is that bright lights? No. No. This is... Scene still? Scene still? Sensual. Yeah. <laughs> Do you think? What, is that glamour? No, dramatic. Dynamic. <laughs> <laughs> right then. Thanks for today. You've been. It's been a pleasure. Thank you very much. Great. Thank you. You've been absolutely so safe. Sorry about your Rose. <laughs> She'll recover. <laughs> anyway. Thank you. Well, take care. See you later. Yeah. Good to see you. Sir. See Bye, you later. Mom. See you later. Thank Bye. you. Bye. Bye. They made it feel really real, and I'm really excited because, like, I'm opening a salon. <laughs> Coming up. Four and five weeks for 30 grand? As the salon becomes more of a reality, Jade's getting more and more angry. I will say that I ain't being funny, mate, but I'm paying you however much I'm paying you. And plus that, deduct the fact and drink as many cups of tea as you want, I'll make them for you. Derek's getting worried about his design. Too much. Hang on, I didn't agree on this. I better give him a call to find out what's going on, because all this is getting changed. And Carl is just getting it in the neck. You might have three jobs, but I have one job that takes up all of your three jobs. I don't need your help then. I need your help now. <laughs>
Yeah, but I do want an input. Like, if you I go... If I go in there and they're all drinking cups of tea, I'll be frying them tea at them and saying, you're not here to drink tea, I ain't paying you that. They've got to have a break. Why are you drinking tea? I will say, look, I ain't being funny, mate, but I'm paying you however much I'm paying you. And plus that, deduct the fact and drink as many cups of tea as you want. I'll make them for you. (laughs) (laughs) Don't you think they're entitled to a tea break? Yeah, of course. Everyone's entitled to a break. I'm the worst person if I don't get food. So, yes, everyone's entitled to a break. Do you need food now? (laughs) No. Okay. Okay. All right, thanks, Nick. See you later. 30k for the bill cost, very low, but we're pulling in favours. We will be able to do it, but I don't want her coming back saying you've got 20 halfway down the line. I've had a chat with Nick, and I'm so not really sick. There's me thinking, yeah, I can do it for 50 grand easy, and I'll have money left to go and buy a pair of shoes. But that turns out all wrong, because I'm going to have to use about 70 grand now. I really hope I don't go over that. So what we're going to do today, as I say, is give you an overview of what you need to know to start your business. We've got some good news and some bad news for you. Something like three out of four businesses will fail, will cease trading in their first year. The first year is really crucial. You need to ask yourself, do you have the personal qualities and the business skills to run a business? And I think perseverance is quite crucial too. Perseverance means just carry on doing it if something goes wrong. Being determined, making absolutely sure that you've learned from your mistakes, but you've carried on. Yeah, persevering, no matter what. If it doesn't go well, I'll shut it down. (laughs) (laughs) You mustn't think that. You've got to think positively. Taxation is something you need to look at. It does have its downside, open to a VAT inspection in the first two years of trading. What's the VAT inspection? What do they do? They come and check all your books, that you're keeping your books and paying paying someone cash, they'll find out. If nobody wants to buy your product or service, there is no point doing it. And you need what we call a USP, a unique selling point. So every product we have has a life cycle and then it will decline. You can see if you've only got one product or one service and then suddenly nobody wants it. Your business structure, finance. So you divide it all up so you get a forecast for the second year of 50% accurate forecast. Dependent on whether you're a limited company or a sole trader, tax and national insurance are dealt with differently. And then there are cooperatives. I mean, where does she want to be in three, six, 12 months' time? All of this is maybe jargon to you at the moment, may not mean an awful lot. It's really important to control finances. It's really important to do some budgets. Work out what you expect your income to be coming in, what you expect your overheads to be and always overestimate the costs of running a business and underestimate your sales. And if the business can still work on that basis, it's likely to work. Do you feel scared? Um, I just feel like I've got to go away. Do an awful lot of more thinking. <laughs> if it was easy, everybody would be doing it. It's not easy. Here she is. Hello. Legally Blonde 3. Ooh. How was it? I'm tiring. What did you learn? <laughs> what did you learn? The lots of stuff, I suppose. That I need to ring a few more people. So I've got to ring, I've got to ring a... Who? People about VAT, you think tax. Was you, you think it was useful? Yeah, it was useful, but like I said, things go in and I come out and they're all gone. When I get home, Ryan's going to ask me and I'm not going to know. We think I'll have lunch all day. This is the lanes. Now, I brought you here because there's lots of little antique shops, right. little knickknacks, and what I want to do today is to go through them, see your style we're looking for. We might find a chandelier, we might find a mirror right, okay. here today. <laughs> Down here, Jade, this Ow. is... This is like the French antique look, okay? I'm not proposing this for the salon, but it's the kind of style, raw iron, this is very French. Not very comfortable. It's not, I don't think it take all weight. No, it's very. <laughs> what <about> don't say. <laughs> Stop doing that, get black eyes. Look, that gold one. You, you are not serious. You do not want that phone. No, it's an old-fashioned gold phone. It's old, it's old-fashioned. 
Can I come in and just, because I might buy a telephone, is that all right? The red one with the hand. She is not getting that telephone, but then I just think she is. You're talking here, hello? Can no, it's the other way around. That's your ear, please. That's, yeah, that's, that's... No! <laughs> <laughs> hello? Bye, bye, Ian. How much is that dress for her? Come on! <laughs> you're just like a night dress. You're yeah, gonna say, be my crutch, now come on. Bye. 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 So sorry, thank you. See, these are nice. So we're looking for like shabby chic, distressed down furniture and things. This is the Philip Stock Sanson Hotel look. Now that's the kind of thing I want for your, for your salon. Now this. Look at that. That, now, that fits in with my face. Now this fits in with my face. Exactly this doesn't, want. this does. That's, this sort of means. Should we buy a couple of them? But that's exactly what you want in your shop for your client. Can you. Oh, Jade, 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 Jade. God, it's massive. See, that's a nice mirror. How much is that? £150. I tell you that would look fabulous. Behind the reception, we're having the voils. We could have that hanging from a chain just behind the reception desk on an angle. So when you walk in, you see your image in the main reception. You don't get it, do you? No. I, I'll, I'll show you later on how to do it. Yeah, we're not having them curtains anymore. We are? Since when? Since I went to the meeting with Nick, he said we're not having them anymore. What are you going to have? Nothing, because he said it looks too tacky. No, I think we should have them. OK, well, we're after. OK, we'll just... took a... No, that's an important part of the design. <laughs> They're nice. Oh, when I was talking to Nick about the thing the other day, he said no curtain, and I agreed with him. I think he's adding too much. Hang on, I didn't agree on this. Well, apparently he did. He said this is where Derek wanted to have the curtains, but we're now not having the curtains because it looks too much and too tacky. He said, so what we're going to do is put shelves here and here and here and here and here and here, so you've got stock to put, so you've got stock room with oh, lights. I'm not too sure about that. He said, because then when you've got this big chandelier that you're going to obviously spend money on, he said, then you've got these, these, well, tacky curtains with light coming out underneath. It's not going to be tacky gonna curtains. Gonna They're going to look like cool the Sanderson Hotel. What you need, you need to have curtains just to claw and close that area. So what you're doing, you're framing. And now the rooms have changed, didn't they, to theme rooms? Themed? <laughs> Do you not know? I'm not having you on, I swear that I've got three, three. Well, uh, treatment rooms, yeah. and they're going to be themed like pink or something in them. Oh, I thought you were going to say like Bangkok or Africa. Oh, no, 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 like, that, like just buy it. And I said, well, we're not having the curtains no more in them. And he said, no. I better give him a call to find out what's going on, because all this is getting changed. Come on. Do you yeah, let's go, down right now. Turn that off, I'm going to eat. I kind of don't know what's really going on, because I'm just, you know, I'm just doing it all, really because she's working. She won't work it, but make my life a lot easier and I'd be able to spend more time with my boys. And I just need her help. That's why I wanted a business, not so much a business partner. I don't care if I've got the money to put in, I'll do it all, but I just needed a companion to, thank you, to sort of be there and take the weight off my shoulders just so I could, like now, I wouldn't have to go around to her and explain to her, I could be over my kids now. Now, which is absolutely mingles. I can't believe I'm walking away from them. I felt awful today, like this. I wanted to hide my nails all day. It's making me feel ill. I don't, I don't feel like a woman or a lady at all, let alone a beauty therapist. I feel like more of a piss therapist. It's fucking doing my head in, to be honest. Come on, then. Right. Well, I've been rushed with my feet trying to sort out our shop. What have you been doing? Because um, looks like over there you've managed to get all your clothes all ironed and hanged up. <laughs> Mine ain't even in the case yet. My poor kids don't even get good night. But yeah, you're all organised. You your house is all clean. Me. Like, come on, what have you, you need been to doing? Make more time. I need to make more yeah, time. Get up earlier. Hang on. Excuse me. I'm you get out of bed at half ten in the No, no, no. Not no more. I don't. Not no more. I used to when I had the easy life. Uh, excuse me. Excuse <laughs> 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 me. I get up half five in the morning. I feed Freddie. Half five. That's no, that's rubbish. Where are my life? That is Freddie's alarm clock now. Ryan oh, my kids up. up. Ryan no, gets up. No, 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 no. I get up. Then I go back to sleep. Then I go back to sleep. Depending on what time the camera crew come man. No, I fucking don't. I was out at about half past nine today, so I had to oh get my earlier God. than I had to fact. Oh, my God, oh, I swear really, to I'll God. You, in the you, you might have three up. jobs, but I have one job that takes up all of your three jobs. Yeah, but Jade, when all the shops are up and running, oh, yeah. I'm going to be there working every day. You're not. No, 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 no. I will be there working every day. You're going to be there nine till six. No, 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 can I just day, tell you? Day in, day out. No, I'll, I'll, I'll just tell you this, I'll just tell you this. I'll be there majority <laughs> of the time, but let me just do this. I don't need your help then. I need your help now. <laughs> so what's been happening then? I'll now show you our shop. Close your eyes. OK. Open and look at it through eye level. <gasps> How good is that? Oh, my God. Right. 
I explained this to you a little bit more. This here is where all the nail bars are going to be yeah. on this side. What they are debating about is Nick doesn't want it, but there it does. Curtains here. Nick doesn't want it because he thinks it's going to look quite tacky. Curtains down there and a big and a big chandelier and all of this. Mm -hmm. Thinks there's too much going on in one space, so they're debating mm -hmm. about that. Can a wheelchair fit through this? Well, a wheelchair can't fit through the door that's in there now. So they weren't thinking about disabled people. If they need to get the wheelchair in, we can bring them out of the bag. We've got 20 grand to get everything with, to towels, get the beds, to get the towels, to get everything. So we have to budget on that. We've already spent Jessica's six grand. Mm. Sanch pay six grand. These are other budgets. These are a grand over. Sanch pay six grand. So that's 12 grand gone already. Out of the 20? Out of the 20. Oh, shit. Before I can sort of think, yeah, right, I've done well, we've done well up in the shop, I'm putting 70 in, I want to make that 70 back, and maybe an extra 10, so I go, yeah, I've got the 70 and I've got a profit. Mm. Yeah, so that's 80 grand in a year, so your turnover is going to have to be, what, a grand a month? Just over a grand a month, wouldn't it? No, more than that. Two grand a month. Two, four, two, three, two. <laughs> more than that. How much a month? That's only 24 grand. Oh, no, so it's going to have to be more than that. We're going to have to make lights because you've month. got to pay all the wages, rent, the business rates all the equipment, all like just the unit bills and stuff, and then get you your money back. Mm. It's going to yeah, be hard. hard work. It's going to be hard work. It's going to be horrible in actual fact. And everyone I spoke to that's done a business have said it's the most stressful time in their life and fallouts happen. So I won't be surprised if we fall out every now and then. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get stressed and high rate. And, oh, I don't know. That's it. That is it. All right, thanks, Nat. You're, you're going to have to go. Because <laughs> I am. She's enough. She's had enough. I've had enough! <laughs> what I see is the camera, you, <laughs> no. I'm walking about his skank or snails. It is worrying, it is scary. Obviously, to Kylie and the other girls, they all look out for me and they all sort of care about me and they want me to waste someone and stuff like that, but it's not as risky or as scary for them because they're not losing anything. Um, and I am. Well, I would be, should I say. Might be, I don't even know. Some people could be sitting at home watching this thinking, for God's sake, Jade, 70 grand, you earn millions or you're a millionaire or whatever they want to think of me. 70 grand is nothing to you, but um, 70 grand is, is a lot of money. Um, I ain't no Miss High Mighty that thinks that I am a multi millionaire or anything like that because, quite frankly, I'm not. And I do need to set something up for some of my boys have got sex for in the future. And I, that's why I pray to God that this does work. You know, don't get me wrong, you're going to get stressed out. I got stressed out and that, but at the end of it, it went all right. And now my boys have got a living off of all of my shops. And I, I would just love to do that. I'd, I'd love to be that successful. Coming up. Jade and her mates have a wild hen party and let it all hang out. What do you think, like? They look really shaggy. There's trouble at the salon. I'm not happy I've probably got the arm. I probably think, what an arsehole. She can't come in on a quick meeting like that, not knowing what she's on about. No paperwork, nothing. They're still going on about curtains. I've really got no time to fluff around about curtains today. And there's more stress with boyfriend Ryan. Ryan's pissed me off. Shut your moaning, will you? I can't wait till you eat. The sooner the better. Jade's setting up her own beauty salon. I own a business! <laughs> She's having problems with the interior. Hang on, I didn't agree on this. I better give him a call to find out what's going on, because all is getting changed. Costs are starting to get out of control. I'm going to have to use about 70 grand now. Oh, yeah, I really hope I've got over that. Jade's no, 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 losing it. I don't need your help then! I need your help now! So what better tonic for her than a hen weekend on the Costa del Sol? 29 of my friends going, 29 girls, it's going to be so exciting. What time does it go to bed, Ryan? Just after one. Just after one o'clock. And, um, what do you call it? I've got up at what time, Ryan? Half three. Half three. So I did Ryan, he's taken me to the airport, he's so tired. Looks like a pink outfit. It's nice. Oh! <laughs> I say it's not it! I say it's not it! Why have I got mine? You've not got your out. Why did I think of that? Been looking like a nugget all morning. See you in a minute. Hello. Mwah. 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 Mwah.
I don't know why it was so fast. <laughs> How many? 520 for lunch, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that is all you're going to say. You give me a video camera. If you're lucky, you might get some clips. If you're not, tough shit, really. But I'm going away now. Um, you can't come with me, I'm afraid, because what happens in my bar stays in my bar. Here's your mic. Good riddance. And I'll see you when I get back. Bye. Oh, I'm so excited. Jeff just, can you have the kids? Of course I can. Come to mine, we can manage, believe. Oh, God, it's a nightmare. Say hello, Moo Cow. Hello, Moo Cow. Let's walk down here. Come and see the pig. He likes pigs, don't you, Bob? Look! Jeff didn't mean it, I suppose, but it's meant for ya. Why do you think I'm a. <laughs> Look at the donkey! He all. Well, I was thinking of putting him on the donkey. What do you reckon? <laughs> Bobby on the cow and Freddie on the donkey. Yeah, I think I'll do some of that. Come and go. We can do this. <laughs> Got to get over lively, though, you know. Quick, ready, go. Go. No, he ain't going under there. Lively. Yeah, he's... Lively. Lively. Yeah. <laughs> no, that dog, you don't like it. <laughs> oh, look. You like him, don't you? I like this thing. Oops. <laughs> Oh, well, look, you're in the pig's farm now. That's it. He's in the pig's farm. Oh, look! <laughs> Do not feed the donkeys, it says. <laughs> but there's a pig in there. What sense does that mean? Do not feed the donkeys. But there's a pig in there. Too late, the donkey's been fed. Give me five. Give me five. <laughs> Why did you do that? What do you reckon uh, Jade's up to right now, Becky? I don't know where she is. Is she in Madrid? Marbella. Oh, Marbella. Oh, my God. Um, what's the time over there? Well, if it's still sunny, she's on the beach sunbathing because me and Jade are sun freaks. Excuse me, tips. Carly, you, you explain last night's antics, could you? Last night, very fun. Very fun. This evening, she's waving. Nothing like that. They look really saggy Ray. down there. It's a lovely. Ray. No, who's that? Ray. Who is it? <laughs> look at the math. Who is it? Mummy. Mummy. That's a really horrible photo of her chest there. Unless it's the way it's taken. That one looks really deformed. 
Oh, well, Lucy, oh, she's enjoying herself. I told you she's at the beach somewhere along the line, didn't Mommy. I? Got back from our bed, half past one this morning. Absolutely knackered. I've lost my voice. It's not too good. Don't really want you around, but you are. Um, and today I've got to work as well. I've got to go to the shop today. Because, uh, uh, Derek, Nick, and, um, Jason, um, are having a meeting, so I've got to go. I have tried to get out of it, but I've got to go. Um, just, to, I'm not going to stay long now. I want to spend time with my boys, probably birthday tomorrow. Did you miss Ryan? No, I didn't. <laughs> not in a horrible way, but I was just... 28 girls, and they're all my friends, and I was just enjoying myself, and it's hard to miss somebody when you're lagging. We keep in the same sanitary, where are we changing that? Oh, well, uh, well the monkey derby. Yeah. Hello? Hello. Hello. Oh. How are you? Well, all right, thank you. Okay. All right, see you there. See you there, see Wait, business, what is going on? Because we've got a problem with curtains, as I'm aware, or no curtains. What, well, it's here? Yes. No, cut, not curtain problem, is it? Over to you. Um, what about the curtains back? The curtains right next. Did you remember you said to me that the curtains there would look very good, it would look quite tacky, and I thought that's what the arrangement was. Remember the original scheme, we were going to yeah. use them as part the of but if we can have these starts, I think it's going to be too, too mm, busy. Don't know. If you think of it all together, it doesn't sound very nice, does it? I've got cows on the wallpaper, tiles in the middle cows of the floor. Cows on the wallpaper? <laughs> tiles in the middle of the floor, and then curtains around it. Yeah, heavens. Saint Tropez, have you got any further with the unit? That's I've actually precious. got the dynamicers. Can you stop it? I've got the dynamics indoors. Do you want to take them out? Just stick them in the car. Put them in the car. The next to the steering wheel, we'll be fine then. You've got the dimensions in the set. Yeah, they'll give me the um, dynamicers, or whatever you call it. Dimensions. The measurers, uh, how, wide, how high and that is. I thought that you both agreed that it was going to look tacky if you had the curtains, and when I see you next, it was one person was saying one thing, another person was saying nothing. So I don't want to see those curtains up until I've seen all of it because if, I don't want you looking tacky. I don't, I don't want you like tacky. she's got cows, but she's got nets, and busy. she's got cows and nets. Who do you think we are? Well, dogs and nets. Nets. Cows and nets. I'm sure I know you're my job. Voils. You can tear the girl out of Bermondsey, but you can't tear Bermondsey out of the girl. <laughs> can I just say, I don't like this woodworm wood. I hate it. We can sort that out. What do you mean, woodworm? It's like old and chipped, and it looks like it's been eaten away by rock violence. Yeah, but it looks like bad to be painted. By rock violence. Okay, wait, is that it? No. Is that what it is? What about start? Before I went away, I had meetings with everyone, so we could all get it. So when I come back, I actually thought we'd be I thought we'd be starting. So I will be on the phone ranting and raving today, because this should be mine as from today. Right. So realistically, when? I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know what's going on. All right, is that it? That is it. Boys, I've got a lovely lady. Thanks very much for oh, the time today. Oh, you left him behind. Come on, you. Well, thank you. Bye. See you again. See you. Bye. 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 She was helpful today, wasn't she? Very <laughs> helpful today. <laughs> In a single word, no. Uh, OK. Oh, for God's sake. I'm not happy to stay. I've probably got the arm. I probably think, what an arsehole, but it was short and sweet. I said what I had to say. They're still going on about curtains. I've really got no time to fluff around about curtains today. I've got more important things to do. I know it's important, this is my shop and this is my project, but today, not only am I tired because I've just got a plane, I've got one crying child, another hungry child, and someone talking about curtains, least of my priorities. I'm going now, girls, I've got a party to sort out as well. See you later, and I hope you get sorted. I leave that camera in charge, my spy and I. Bye. And I've got to get wedding outfits. I've got three weddings to go to. So I've got three wedding dresses to get. And also a birthday outfit and also a polo cherry outfit. Not only am I going to be skinned, but I've got no time. Somebody needs to have a word with Jade about the fact that this is actually her project and she's got to be involved. She can't just come in on a quick meeting like that, not knowing what she's on about. No paperwork, nothing. Can I have a look in there? Oh! Can I? Ah! Because I just got back from home and I'm quite brown, I don't want to put jeans on because um, I believe that when you wear jeans and trousers, it makes your tan go quicker and it keeps blowing up. I feel like Marilyn Monroe. Ouch!
Plan for today, we're going to Hamley's to get Bobby's presents. I'm not happy. Ryan's pissed me off. <coughs> my nerves. It's because we're And as you can tell, he talks a lot as well. But I'm waiting for you to apologise. I ain't apologising to you, no way. You knew you was in the because you apologised. Like, yeah, I made I sense to your apology because you always do it. I was talking to you. Oh, I didn't think you accepted it. I haven't. Thanks, mate. Hi. That's nice. Some communication would be good, I was Ryan. Oh, you don't have to answer everything, like you said. <laughs> Shut your moaning, will you? I can't I wait till you eat. The sooner the better. You're moaning when you don't eat. Yeah, not as much as you. Hello. Ah, nice to them. Any chance being nice to me? Well, what's over there, Harry Potter? Go on there. Should you go down there? Yeah. He likes things with wheels, tractors. Oh, he did have one of these, but I think I lost it. Giant alphabet puzzle that I teach him. Oh, look, Ray, I like that. I'll try it. Break bit. his neck, though. Tractor? Yeah, I like that tractor. Yeah, I have that tractor. Oh, should we get him a new golf thing, right? Because these ones, he's lost everything. Yeah. Yeah, I really like that one. You can take that when you go golf with him. Yeah, I'd take the aeroplane, wouldn't you? He's not going to be injured. All right, then, we'll leave it. No, no, no. Like, everyone has to fly a kite. But yeah. it's three upwards. There's only two. Oh, I'll just get it. <laughs> no, it's hard work now. I had a break while she was away. It's back to work. Getting lugged around everywhere. Pulled here and there. Easy, easy. All he's done since I've been away is eat, go out drinking and go out partying. Well, now I'm back, things are changing. No, I'm only joking. It's just that when I'm back, he don't want to go out. He just loves me so much, he likes to be by my side all the time. Not really. Hardly see you. Coming up, it's Jade and Bobby Jack's birthday. Ryan's booked a romantic night out. Gordon Ramsay's restaurant. Oh, oh Gordon! Go she loves Ramsay. But what's Jade playing at? Well, Ryan, we're going to go out and do something special then. Um, then I was quite happy to have the boys. Who's got the boys tonight? Oh, sick pair of trainers. Bob the Builder trainers. I hate things like that, because she knows I do. So he won't be wearing them when he's with me. Bob the Builder trainers. No way. <laughs> well, uh, I was getting out of the carriage this morning. I don't know if they'll fit. I didn't know what size, so... Oh, thank you. Mwah. <laughs> I bought her a birthday cake. I did bought her a birthday cake? Yeah, but Bobby hasn't got a birthday cake, so she's gonna have to use that. Oh, why haven't Bobby got a birthday cake? I think Jeff, she said Jeff forgot. Jeff so, forgot the birthday That's what she said, yeah. I had a cake and she said, who's that for? Well, she and knows I, you've got her a cake. Well, she's seen yeah. a cake, she says, who's it for me? I says, no, no. And she went, all right then. So, like, so I didn't want her to know because she's not expecting it. That was a surprise. Yeah. Okay, so. Well, I might just go and get one. Come in, right? It's got to be down there, isn't it? Is that the way we drove in? Wait, I'm trying to think. Look, there's the Tesco's Express, and it was down here somewhere. Yeah, I'll pack my Tesco's in. Yeah, we're here. We'll do it right here and go straight up. Now she went. Excuse me. Got the birthday cage. Hold on. Yep. Yeah, oh God, definitely. Okay, this is a number two candle for Bobby, yeah? Oh, it stands up in there, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Should we do that? Yeah, yeah. So we stand up with Bob's and then two for the J. Wait, Wendy, you've got a Hello, where are you? Tesco's. 
Uh, cake for Bobby. Oh, my God. Okay, buddy. All right, then. I'll be back in a minute. All right, then. Bye. Bye bye. Whoa! Look at that, you like them? Jade trying to find out where he was. She don't know about mm. your little cake, does she? No. Is that the one she's talking about? Yeah. I've booked somewhere, but it's in London and like, oh, that's a bit far. What time's it booked for, right? Nine o'clock. Oh, you've got plenty of time. Yeah. You've got plenty of time, right? It's in London and like, oh, that's a bit far. Gordon Ramsay's restaurant, but. Oh, oh go there. there. But she loves Ramsay. Different. Yes, she yeah. loves Ramsay. Kiss me if you've had a nice time. Mwah! Thank you. Starving. Please. She best appreciate this. Yep. Huh? Uh, yeah. Thomas Thank Tank you. is. Huh? That's the only one. That's why it's turning out to be enough for you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I think, excuse me, only doing that one first, if that's it. Yeah, because you don't know about that one. We're not doing both together? No, separate, yeah. I don't know, I didn't know whether to like, do both birthday cakes together or separately. No, Jade don't know we've got a birthday cake for her. Thanks for coming everybody, uh, celebrating Bobby's second birthday with us. It's also um, a, another kid's birthday, so if everyone could yeah, just we'll join in cake. for Jay. <laughs> 24 a day. It's a bit late now, don't you reckon? Come on, boy, get a move on, mate. Good, thanks very much for coming today. If you all want to get your key off and get in a pool, I think it'd be a great time there. Anything you want to say, Bobby? No. <laughs> Bye, thank you. Have we got another one? No, that's your pool. Ryan. I know, but like, I didn't know they were doing it straight away. I didn't know that, right? Appreciation of the cake was minimal. I see, because it was Bobby's thing, weren't it? And then mine coming along after, and I was like... Yeah, I was, I was meant to do it after, but I didn't know he was going to do it. I said to him I was going to do it. Yeah. Thank you very much. I find it quite embarrassing. Oh, you did? Well, I was thinking, I thought... Why would you find it embarrassing? I was going to start singing back there. <laughs> and then when I just brought a cake over, and you went, oh, Bobby's got another cake. I thought. Yes, I thought it was four. Cool. It's got 24 on it. Yeah, Who's got the boys tonight? Who's got the boys? Don't forget, Jeff Cam. So we have. Hello. I said to Jake, it's her birthday, obviously today, so if her and Ryan were going to go out and do something special, then um, then I was quite happy to have the boys, but she said she's too knackered and can't be bothered, so I think she's going to have them. Next time on Jade Salon. Is Jade about to lose her mind? Guy around here in Paris for parties. I've like got a million other thousand things to be doing. Her boyfriend? Enough! <laughs> and before it's even got started, her salon? The interest is gone. Nothing's worn off.
There's more time with Jade next Monday. On the way next, though, things are hotting up when love is in the air for the interns. It's a brand new Grey's Anatomy in just a moment. Yeah.